Cheese at Home Decor right now, creating your own bar carts. It's a creative way to showcase ready-to-drink cocktails, and there are no rules. <laughs> There's an article about this in this month's edition of Madison Magazine, and the managing editor, Andrea Bailing, is with us now. And dare I say, you brought the bar cart from your office? <laughs> <laughs> Good work. Did, yes. Yeah. Don't we all need one of those? Yeah. My. yeah, it being Wednesday today, I wish it was Friday. Right. But, um, so yeah, this is a couple of the things that we featured in our um, in our September issue. And it's kind of we have two bar carts, and we got them both from Rewind Decor, which has amazing bar carts for um, not you know not super expensive. Mm -hmm. They're affordable. Um, but one bar cart is more like the at home. You know, they want just to open and pour. Um, so these are all local. Um, local um, products, old-fashioned bourbon from uh, Yahara Bay, um, Ale Asylum just came out with this hard seltzer, um, Stray. Oh, look at um, that beautiful can. Yeah, yeah. All of these are awesome. Bourbon Smash from Plain Spoke Cocktails and a Refresh Lit Rattler from Wisconsin Brewing Co. So these are just pop them, pour them for your guests, and get on with your party. So what do you use for the cart? Just anything that you want? Like a You can get bar carts all over the place now, but honestly, Rewind Decor locally is one of the best places. Yeah, we oh, should there you go. Um, both of these were from Rewind Decor. They were both affordable, both beautiful, and he refurbished both of them. So he has a really good wow. eye for finding these um, and bringing them back to life. So yeah, that left one was more the more casual, um, you know, not the, the mixologist um, at home entertainer. And then the other side here, we've got we feature a couple of um, other um, uh, that you, you can make other cocktails with these that are a little more fancier. Stateline Distillery um, and old, uh, and this is from uh, Wallershine. Mm -hmm. Oh, so, it's nice. You're featuring local products. Yeah, yep. And then yeah, other interest items that you can add to your bar card. This is from Rewind Decor too. Cool ice bucket. Um, you know, glassware. This is a cool um, bottle opener from Fowerbach Brewery, which is the first um, Madison brewery to oh, wow. ever be. Yeah, so kind of conversation starters that um, would be really fun to have at your at-home party. Now, I know the bar carts are kind of all over the place, but did you have to do a little digging and searching to find these, like, items here, the ones with a little flavor? Yeah, <laughs> well, it, it's fun, though, you know, for me, I'm a person that likes to kind of look through things yeah. and, okay, this goes with that, and it's really fun to, you know, a bar cart isn't just about, you know, finding the right drinks for your party, but also, like, what kind of feel do you want this bar cart to have? And it really kind of, think, adds to the party experience. So you do it for a party, but do people sometimes have, like, a permanent bar cart in their, <laughs> you yes. know, in their house? Absolutely, yep, and you have a couple of key spirits that you would use to make cocktails, so you can offer a couple of options. Um, the These canned ones are nice, that it's just, you give a ton of options, and you just open it for them, but mm -hmm. then others, it's like, okay, I can have a sipping brandy for, you know, some people, but then Maybe that you know other people want an after dinner cocktail that you can offer, so it's nice to have a couple options. Super fun! Oh, it's a yeah. fun alternative to just kind of the liquor cabinet, right? Definitely. <laughs> do it non-alcoholic as well. Yeah. You can do whenever you want. You can totally. read all about it in this month's issue of Madison Magazine. Andy, good to see you. Yeah, good to see you. Thanks guys. so much. Yeah, Thank thanks. You. So there's. More